What's up, everyone? It's KJ. Hi, everyone. It's Madeline Petch, and I'm about to give my take on some of the internet's weirdest questions. Here we go. This, this is, is Alan's, Alan's Debate, Debate Club. Club. Do you get both armrests if you are in a middle seat? It depends who you are. If you're KJ Upper, then absolutely 100%. Yes, you do. No! You do not! Absolutely not! That is no! Well, it's whoever also sits down first. I feel like when you're sitting down on a plane and you're stuck in the middle seat, you want to take both of them before anyone else can get them. Unless you're sitting next to a beautiful girl or something and you want, you know, you can lend her one of the sides if possible. And if you're sitting next to two beautiful women, then unfortunately you're gonna have to sit like this. Unless you're me. Now here's the thing, I'm a firm believer that everyone should get one, right? So it's like if you're, if everyone, if the first person is sitting in the row has their arm on the right one, then everyone should have the right one. And then I guess someone might get two. If everyone's on the left, then you can, but I think you can share. Like I'm more of a sharer if I'm sitting by somebody. I'll, uh, you know, have a little bit of my arm on the middle one and then they can share with me. It's not super awkward. Sometimes they're a little bit bigger. If they're not, you're making a friend today. So I don't think anyone should get both though. I think everyone needs to share. Let's all share. Bachi or Bughead? Um, Bughead. Seems to be the most popular opinion these days. <laughs> Shoney or Bughead? You guys know my answer. Okay, I'm biased, obviously. I'm a big Shoney fan for obvious reasons, uh, but I also love Buckhead. I think they're so adorable. Any cuddling scene with Buckhead, I'm a big fan of, but for obvious reasons, I'm gonna have to pick Shoney. I think they're so cute together and I'm a big fan, so all right. How would a dog wear pants? On its hind legs or two pairs over its front and back legs? I think a dog if it was wearing pants, it would be both the front and the back legs. What? <laughs> or is that just like a jumpsuit kind of situation? I think it's, yeah, it's the dog has four legs, right? We have two legs, dogs have four legs, it would be all four, four, four legs, yeah. I'm imagining my dog in jeans. I don't know, I mean, if we put human standards on a dog, then I'd say the back legs, obviously, because it's meant to cover your private area. But since they're meant to go on your legs and dogs have two sets of legs, I would say both, but then no, because you have to put a sweater. If you're gonna put a shirt on your dog, right? If we're gonna go full outfit, then the front, I guess the legs are actually arms, the front two legs? So if we're really getting into it and you put your dog on its hind legs, then the two front legs would be in the shirt or sweater and the back legs would be in the jeans. So I'm gonna say on its back legs, decisiveness. Where would you be going if you had pants on? To a meeting or something? I don't know. You're the one asking me the questions, bro. Are you still naked if you're wearing socks? Yes. You are. I guess it depends on what body part you identify naked with, right? Like I feel naked if I'm not wearing a bra that feels, even with clothes on, it feels naked, right? I bet you, if you looked up a definition, naked is defined by no clothing whatsoever and socks are an item of clothing. I, you know, when I'm doing frisky things, I like to keep my socks on. Just comfort for me, it's just important, I think. Um, and yeah, you know, naked, to, to be naked usually is when you show your private parts is the general kind of consensus, I think. So yeah, you're naked if you're wearing socks. So I'm gonna go with, you're not naked? But I'm sure if we kept going and they didn't move to the next question, I would find a reason as to say why you would be naked. Yeah, eggs, fried eggs. I got a pair of socks with fried eggs on them. Charles has them now. Do you wash your legs in the shower? Absolutely, move on. Like, yes, absolutely, no question. Lather it up, get your, you gotta get your feet. Like, your feet are gonna be dirty, yeah, yes. And if you don't, go do that right now, please. Your legs need to be washed too. I have to shampoo my legs, my legs are so hairy. Yeah, you should wash your legs. You should wash your whole body if you're in the shower. You don't have a shower and not wash certain parts of your body, that's weird. I'm very passionate about that. Okay, the internet is beyond weird. Do you agree or disagree with me? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for having me, Ellen.